So I'm like, I right, bet. Let me just save this shit for stream to really watch the whole thing and see what she talking about. I've been like this all. Verify game bang? Yeah, you don't know that nigga started Bronze Drill. Yeah! I've always been confident. I've always been loud. I've always been. I need water. Outgoing, like. You right, gang. You my bad. Enjoyed entertaining. Yeah, weirdo. Bro, free Tory, bro. That nigga innocent, bro. When I look now, I'm like, dang, we really did this. Mm -hmm. When did you know you were good at this? God damn. I feel like I wrote my first like rap when I was seven, and I do not I care. Like, Get to the story. And when I got what's the story? Success, which brings us to July uh, 12, 2020. Let's go there, Megan. That night changed everything for you. Rapper Tory Lanez has been charged with shooting artist Megan Thee Stallion. Tory in jail? Now nah, he's not in jail, but if he speaks up, say anything, he going to jail. It, for me, he's literally out on bail, so he's literally, for me, he can go to jail, nigga. Like, he's accused, like, for me, he's blackballed from the goddamn industry. Like, I mean, free that nigga, bro. Megan the Stallion hit by multiple gunshots. There was an argument in the car. It, it was... And the only thing I know for sure, I don't know anything that happened. All I know for sure is that she done switched the story like 80 times. And a couple days after she got shot in her foot, nigga, she was twerking that ass. Argument because I was ready to go and everybody else wasn't ready to go. Mm -hmm. But that's like normal friend yes. stuff. Like, yeah. we fuss about silly, silly stuff all Nigga said already, piece of, ASAP was never locked up. Should've aimed for the head because I ate this bitch. That's crazy. Tom. Mm -hmm. But. I never. Bro, just know she's under Rock Rockefeller Nation or Rock Nation, whatever the fuck. With Jay Z and them, just letting y'all know, bro. And Tory was trying to get out his label. There's a lot of shit behind the scenes, bro. There's more to this. There's more to the story than just he shot her and this and that. Feel me? I put my hands on anybody. I never raised my voice. Six ten versatile like, paint piece is crazy. Where it was like, it shouldn't have got this crazy. It shouldn't have escalated to right. the way that it did. Can you just briefly walk us through what happened that night? It starts you at a party. There's no party tears in her eyes, bro. Uh had went there and we were just hanging out and i was ready to go oh yeah I, yo you know what's so crazy i forgot kylie was even a part of this bro she was a part of this this shit too and she was just like nah i'm rich and white i ain't got nothing to do with this shit because i had been there yeah and then and 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 kylie has more to do to this do with this than um what people think because oh two years ago when this bitch got shot in the foot, bro, why the fuck Kylie posted on her Instagram a picture of her goddamn foot out of nowhere? Like, you can't tell me that wasn't, like, calculated and planned or she wasn't trolling or something, like. All day. So you guys end up in a car. You, Tory Lanez, your friend at the time, Kelsey, and his driver slash security. You're trying so hard to cry on Tory Lanez, whose real name is Daystar Peterson, is a Grammy-nominated rapper and singer from Canada. Kelsey Harris was one of Megan Thee Stallion's best friends from Houston. There was an argument, and you get out of the car, right? The, at that point, the argument wasn't even with me. Like, the argument was with the two people in the back seat. Who's the two people in the back seat? Tell the story, bro. Give him a tip, bro. Wait, who's winning? One on one to 100 minutes in the Memphis. Three minutes to go, chat. Oh, my God. So I asked the driver to pull the car over. Like, I'm done with this. And I should have stayed out of the car. Like, I should have not got back in the car. You never knew Tori was, was like, Canadian. Megan, just get back in the car. We almost there. Like, just get back in. Mm -hmm. So I get back in the car. It's like it's getting worse. The like, arguing in the car. The arguing in the car is getting worse. And I don't want to be in this car no more. Like, because I see it's getting crazy. Mm -hmm. So I get out and the she's car allowed, and it's like everything happens. And it's crazy so. how there's no, and it's, I thought it was, I thought it was guilty until, no, I thought it was innocent until proven guilty. This nigga's literally on restrictions, like, like he did it or some shit. Like he can't speak on it, he can't even allude to it. If he say something that has nothing to do with it, it sound like it do, he's going to jail, nigga, like, but she could just come out and freely talk about it. Oh, so fast. Like, what the fuck? And all I hear is this man oh, screaming, is. He said, dance. <laughs> <laughs> That's dead not funny if it actually happened. <laughs> he said, dance, bitch. <laughs> and all I hear is this man screaming. Is, he said, dance. And he starts shooting. And I'm just like, oh my God. 
Like he shot a couple of times. Mm -hmm. And I, I so was is so he scared. in the car shooting from the car, Megan? He is he... standing up over the window okay. shooting. Stand... When did he leave the car, though? Because you just said you got out the car while they was in the car. Then you got back in the car, and they're still in the car. You said you don't want to be in the car. And then all of a sudden, he's standing up. He's standing over the window. First of all, if this nigga's in the back seat and the front seat, bro, it sounds like it's a big-ass car. And Tori can't see over the window, bro. So what the fuck? His short ass. I don't understand. Mm -hmm. And I didn't even want to move. I didn't want to move too quick. Like, because I'm like, oh, my God, if I take the wrong step, I don't know if he can shoot something that's, like, super important. I don't know if he could shoot me and kill me. Like, Were you afraid for your life at that I time? I was really scared because I had never been shot at before. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to lie, bro. She could dead be telling the truth, but... This is horrible acting. Even if she was telling the truth, this is horrible acting, you know what bro. What, what do you think that happened? Because he was there and shit. He was flirting with Kylie. He was flirting with Kylie, okay. Her and Kylie got into an argument with Tory Lanez. Her and Kylie got into an argument with Tory Lanez, okay. He tried to attack Kylie and Kylie shot him. She tried to. <laughs> 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 bro, shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> she just said Kylie shot Megan. Bro, Meg will beat that bitch ass, bro. That's why she shot her. And I looked down at my feet, cause I With wasn't three bullets even. three in her, Megan would still the be The adrenaline Kylie is ass. pumping so hard. I'm not sure if he hit me. Like y'all remember when Tory got out the chair after freestyling, it was still the same height. That's what I'm saying. He ain't look over no motherfucking window. I feel it, but I don't understand what's happening. So I look down at my feet. and I'm like, oh my god, like I'm really bleeding. Bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> crawling somebody's Man, driveway. First of all, how y'all saying that she gonna that she could beat up Kylie, but she can beat up Lane? He has the gun. But Kylie has the gun. I mean, and what is he saying? Bro, she's Toy inferior, bro. That... You know why she's inferior? Why? Because she lacks melanin. Apologizing, he's. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Please don't tell nobody I'll give y'all a million dollars if y'all don't say nothing. A million dollars? Bro, you're already a millionaire at this point, I'm pretty sure, nigga. It was already hot girl summer. And I'm like, what are you talking about? Like, what are you offering me money right now? Help me. Like, help me. And if you're sorry, just help me. Like, but at that moment, we didn't even make it to to the house. Like somebody had already called the police, and it was like so many of them. It was helicopters. I was like, oh my god, we all about to die. Like the George the George Floyd incident had just happened. The police are definitely very much shoot first, ask questions after. So mm -hmm. I'm like, after a hot gun okay. in the car, I'm bleeding. I've been shot. They about to kill somebody. Okay, my my question is. Why is this case taking so long? Like, every time I hear the story, there's only one part of the story that stays consistent every time. And that's after she gets shot, the cops is already, like, filming basically there. Because motherfuckers already called, I guess, from arguing and shit. They ain't a rich white neighbor or whatever. So it's a hot, loaded gun. She's bleeding. And she didn't want to tell the police nothing. Or whatever. For me, that's that's the part of the story. But it's like no fingerprints was taken. Like no fingerprints was matched to the weapon. No weapon was found. Like I, I, it just don't add up, bro. Like like something bad is about to happen. Mm -hmm. so, so like for me, she got shot in her foot, but none of the tendons was hit, and then she was twerking three days later. Like I, I just, I'm just so fucking confused, bro. Somebody hears the gunshots, they call the police. The police come, and they say what to you? They tell everybody to get out, get the, out car. the car. TMZ obtained video from that night. And it, you can see the footage of me in the <laughs> swimsuit, right. limping backwards, feet bleeding. Yeah, you could definitely see the blood steps. <laughs> she and definitely got shot. Say to you, what happened here? I think. I don't remember everything they said to me, but I remember them asking me what's happening, what, what happened to you. And I didn't want them 
to kill any of us mm -hmm. or shoot any of us. Mm -hmm. So I just said I stepped on glass mm -hmm. because I didn't. Why want... did you say that? Why didn't you say? I don't. That? She just told you why she said that. She didn't want nobody to get killed and shit. So like I said, if she is telling the truth, this W means. Cause yeah, I don't know if y'all remember 2020, but it was going crazy in 2020, bro. It was going crazy with the uh, civil rights and black people dying every five seconds, bro. I don't want to watch this. Close your eyes. Shot me. I didn't, for some reason, I was just trying to protect all of us because I didn't want them to kill us. Like, even though this person just did, just did this to me, mm -hmm. my first reaction still was to try to save us. Like, mm -hmm. I didn't want to see anybody die. Mm -hmm. <laughs> die? So I just said, mm -hmm. I stepped on glass. <laughs> bro, all this never not one tear came out, bro. I, I, I don't know, bro. So when I see... People trying, trying to really use that hard. against me. Like, trying to act like I'm lying. Oh, she stepped on glass. She never got shot. I'm the one who said I stepped on glass. I was lying to protect all of us. Mm -hmm. And I, sometimes I wish I really would have never said that. You wish you would have just told the truth? I wish I would have told the truth, but I, if it saved all of us from dying, then that's just probably what it was meant to be. Mm -hmm. So when you told the police you stepped on glass, did they believe you? I don't know. So how did you go from? Well, I thought they the heard glass. gunshots did because you go to the of people called the police. So they took me straight to the, the hospital, hospital. Mm -hmm. and the police questioned me, and I said it was just glass. You still bitch acting like they gonna mag dump the entire group, and she said, "Nah, shut your stupid ass up, Cass, because they probably would, nigga. Because if she says she got shot, then they go look for the gun, and they realize that shit hot and got it on them or was in the car. Feel me? You don't know how trigger happy they was at the time." Like, what the fuck? A black in a white neighborhood, nigga bleeding, somebody shot the gun, and it was around the time when he was killing mad black people. Stuck with that I story. I stuck with it. It was glass. And right as the officers My were God, like, okay, we're done with this. We leaving. The doctor came in, and he was like, you know, you got bullets in both of your feet. Like, you got yeah, I remember this in this picture. Foot, and it's like right on the back of your Achilles. Mm -hmm. And I'm like... There is a medical report that says that there were bullets uh, that you had been shot. Mm -hmm. And the medical report also says that to this day you still have bullet, still bullet fragments, fragments in, in your my foot. feet. And there are still many people as we sit here today, Megan, that don't even believe you were shot. The, there is um, a hot gun in the car. Yeah. What, what else? What, what happened? In text messages. So she didn't see herself get shot. She didn't, like, she didn't see herself get shot. I, she didn't see herself get shot. She didn't see him shoot her. I don't think she's seen him shoot her. He probably did shoot her. Probably was an accident, probably on purpose. But she clearly did not see it happen. She just got shot. She just got shot. Messages obtained by CBS News. Kelsey Harris, the other woman in the car, texted Megan's security guard saying, Help, Tori shot Meg. Oh, shit. I really thought that we were all friends. And it's... Sometimes I feel like I put the blame on myself because when my mom passed, I just felt like I was looking for some type of family environment and I was letting so many people in and I didn't care who it was. I just wanted to feel like I got family and I got people that care about me. Was good. And just I could hang out with everybody and I, I was just going through it. What was the nature of your relationship with Tory Lanez? Because Big he round eggs in my head. What, the heat one? Believe that it was a my head. sexual relationship, that it was... Uh, that you two were dating? What was the nature We of were your... not dating. We what were really name? close. We were friends. We hung out like every day. And his mom passed too. So when I felt like... I wasn't dating? Yeah, they probably wasn't dating, but y'all definitely was fucking, nigga. Like, I heard that album. Sound like I was fucking. We were bonding over, over that. that. Mm -hmm. And... Did you have an intimate relationship with him? Like sexual? Yeah, yeah. Did you have... <laughs> did you... Megan, did you have a sexual Tell the truth. Tell the truth. Relationship with Tory Lanez, yes, that's my question. Um, what do you mean, um? Like, did you fuck or did you not fuck? I didn't have a sexual relationship. Bro, you're lying. She just lied, bro. She just lied, bro. I can't believe nothing for the past nine minutes after you just lied like that. Bro, the album clearly said that y'all fucked, bro. And then you clearly just stuttered like five times, bro. Like, you, what's, how you so stuck? If someone asks me if I fuck somebody, I'm not going to say, 
uh, 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 like niggas, yes or no, nigga. Relationship with Tori. So why do you think he's putting out the story that the two of you had a relationship and that you're making the whole thing up? I think that he is trying to deflect from the fact that he c committed a crime. Tory Lanes pleaded not guilty to assault and weapons charges related wow. to the shooting. We asked his attorney about Megan's allegations in this story. She responded that they look forward to addressing Ms. Pete's claims, including her inconsistencies, discrepancies, and omissions when his case goes to trial later this year. Everybody, my, I don't think any of this is for them. Like, it's so a blessings on one hand, but I'm grateful. When I make it home, look to the sky and I say thank you. I peeked the snakes up in the grass, I couldn't play cool. If they put the up and leave, nigga, they was mental. 